to show you the puppies today individually so you can see their markings. Sometimes it's a little easier in video um, than trying to look in pictures. This is little Winnie we're starting with here. She is a black and white female. Um, I tell you, these guys are doing great as far as size. Uh, Piper feeds them quite often, and they are just plump, healthy little puppies. Winnie's got a full saddle, just a couple little markings there that may um, close in as she grows. And that is Winnie. The next one we have here will be a black and white male. This is Stetson. Can you look at the camera? There you go. Uh, Stetson. Stetson um, is also almost full saddle, but he's got a little bit more white on his back. Some little marks there. Some of those may close in and some of them may stay as he grows. Uh, but that is Stetson, black and white male. Let's see if I can keep track of eight puppies here. Uh, let's see. The next one we have here, this is Ruger. He is another black and white male. And... You can see a little bit of a freckling coming in on his, or sorry, not freckling, but the nose was just kind of turning darker there. Um, on the black and white puppies, they will turn black. They're usually born pink. Ruger is completely full saddled all the way around there. And he's a handsome little guy, aren't ya? Yeah. But I tell you, lifting these guys up to the camera, they, um... It gives my arms a workout. They're no petite little things, that's for sure. Uh, let's see. I set you guys down and then I have to remember you're not supposed to move. Can't you just stay in order? <laughs> All right. Here we have, let's see, we have little Annie. Annie is a uh, liver and white female. And Annie is already spoken for. Um, she's a beautiful little girl here. And you can see her markings. Um, nice liver and white. And all the way around, I think this side kind of looks a little bit like a heart on her. And that is little Annie. Um, let's see, the next one we'll get here is Dixie. She's a black and white female. Uh, she's the smallest in the litter currently. Um, but not by much. They're all pretty close in size. Dixie, if you remember, was the little one who was born with um, black on her nose already. Yeah, you gonna say hi? A smile? Oh yeah, so precious. She's pretty full saddled as well. She's just got a couple little white marks here on her back. And that is Dixie, black and white female. Um, let's go to Colt. Mm, Colt, <laughs> you are a little porker. <laughs> Colt's um, one of my biggest, I think. Uh, there's a couple of them that kind of been competing every night for uh, the largest puppy. But um, this is Colt. He is a black and white female. His little nose is starting to turn uh, dark, too. Sometimes they sleep with their little tongue out like this. Oh, and it's so precious. <laughs> Um, Colt is not quite as full saddled like some of the other ones. He's a little bit more spotted. So you'll see his black and white here. And that could change as he grows. And he may have a little bit more black on him as he um, gets bigger. But black and white male. And let's see. Cheyenne. I need to get you, sweet girl. This is Cheyenne. She is a liver and white female, and she's the one who's got all the white on her with just a couple little liver spots here. Um, almost looks like there might be some ticking that will come in as she grows, but that's not for certain. Hard to tell at this point. Um, <laughs> there's little Cheyenne, liver and white female. All right, so they are one week old today. And doing fabulous. Little Ringo, I'm not going to show you today. He's in his own little nest keeping warm so that he can um, rest in between feedings and hopefully convert some of those calories to a little bit of weight gain. And we'll just do what we can for the little man and keep praying and rooting for him. So there you have it.